Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. My name is Lacey. If you're new here, if you're not, then welcome back. What are y'all doing? All right, look at this mess. This is the worst my trailer has been in a long, long time. When I tell you there is stuff, look at that. There is stuff everywhere. So if you've been around lately, then you know that I take care of my papa every day and I go all the way to my mama's every single day, an hour away, and I get home late. Um, we all do. My daughter has therapies and stuff like that, lots of appointments. And this particular week here, it was really out of whack. We were going, going, going nonstop. As you can see, we were home just long enough to basically destroy the place and head back out again. So I got a mess on my hands and I'm going to tackle it today. And I'm going to be completely honest, I almost did not film this because I was like, whoo, this is just too bad. Do I really want anybody to see my house like this? And the answer to that is, of course not. <laughs> I don't want anybody to see my house like this. Nobody would, right? I stopped and thought for a second, and I was like, you know what, I'm going to put my pride aside. And I had to remind myself that my channel is not just about me. Somebody else out there, even if it's just one person, could be going through something in their life where at the end of the day, they have to decide, do I clean my house or do I get some rest? Because the next day is going to be rough. So I say all that to say this, I could have easily decided, you know, just to pretty much get everything cleaned up out the way off the floors and off the tables and countertops and just left the things that I needed to do like sweeping or vacuuming wiping things down and stuff like that i could have cleaned up all the actual like mess mess the clutter and stuff like that and i could have just showed that part i could have started filming there um and nobody would be none the wiser you know nobody would be none the wiser i don't know if that's how you say it but anyway you know what i mean but who would that help in that situation nobody you know um it wouldn't help the people who need to see it um it wouldn't help it wouldn't help me it would have been a lot harder because i would have been going around my butt to get to my elbow you know to uh basically clean up before i actually clean just to show you know the basic stuff so I encourage you if you are you know in a position like me um where like i said i'm a caretaker of my papa who's in hospice uh this particular week my daughter was in the hospital um and it, it just it got out of control you know things get out of control and i could have easily made it look like it wasn't and um that's just my point there and i just want y'all to remember you know if you ever get discouraged when you're looking at all the different kinds of social media we have these days and you're like wow am i the only person out here who just does not have it together i promise you're not and just keep in mind that you only see what people want to show you that is totally okay because showing something like this showing you know the the rough parts y'all the rough parts of life i mean it does put you in a vulnerable spot it puts me in a vulnerable spot but it's totally worth it because i just know that at least one person will get encouragement out of this video and at the end of the day that is really what i care about All right, let's get into it. So on this particular day, the only thing that I had time to do was the living room and the kitchen. I will have another video where I clean the bedrooms and the bathrooms. I have to split it up um, because I, I just, realistically, there is no way that I can tackle the whole trailer in one day, especially not in this state. Um, so y'all are only gonna see the living room and the kitchen and um, just keep an eye out for my next video, which will hopefully be um, the bathrooms and the bedrooms and stuff. lord y'all do y'all know how bad i wanted to just take my arm and just rake all this stuff right into the trash can but i was like you know what i'm gonna go through it i'm gonna see what i need to keep what i don't need to keep and just put everything where it needs to go Sunshine, 
just gonna dance Fall for the rhythm of sonic romance Pulsing concrete on the my feet City is my club tonight Hips way under traffic lights Streets are glowing neon bright It's a dance floor in moonlight New age and life can get crazy I just sit away like woo If I'm too serious then I might go crazy I just sit away like woo Side note, y'all. Speaking of sides, clearly I've been eating them because, um, look at a gut. I lost like 30-something pounds, um, maybe close to 40 not too long ago, and guess who gained it all back? Me. Um, so that's another job for another day. I'm going to be working on that here shortly, too. Um, but where would I find the time? I don't have it right now. Um, but I, ha I have some ideas. I have some plans. But for right now, I just want y'all to pretend that I am slim and trim and that I got it going on like a pot of neck bone, okay? Okay, okay, look at there. There's a kitchen table up underneath all that mess. Y'all, that looks good. That is satisfying. You believe that you're not my type. Truthfully, you'll be all mine, all mine, all mine. Talk to me, you wanna know why. You believe that you're not my type. Truthfully, you'll be all mine, all mine, all mine. I wanna put you in my pocket. Take you everywhere I go. Friendly reminder to not forget to clean off your vent hood thing or whatever it's called over the stove um, because I forget it almost every single time and that joker gets dusty. my mind see a face in a stranger as I pass him by I, I swear sometimes I can hear you from the other side I can't make out the words but it's a voice I recognize one look at this photograph the tears come flooding and my mind starts rushing back To the places we used to live Ain't it cruel how it all ends just like that? How come life takes the best of us? You were only 17, just growing up Tell me why does it hurt so bad? When 
look at this photograph you that night before it all went down, down. Didn't know what to say, so I just shut my mouth. It's too late, now all I can do is make you proud. One look at this photograph, it feels come flooding and my mind starts rushing back to the place. Y'all, I got one of these little mesh um, sink strainer things. It came in a two-pack from Dollar General. I think it was a dollar. And this one is a big one, and I put that one in the sink. And then the other one, I've done already, I've done, I've already lost it. Um, it was like a tiny small one. I'm pretty sure it may be for going in like, um, I don't know, the bathtub or something to catch hair that goes down the drain, but mm, I don't know. I can't find it. All right, if you've been here, then you know that this sink is about the bane of my existence. I do not know what kind of material it is. I would say it feels like almost like PVC pipe or something. Um, so it's not porcelain. It's not, um, you know, it doesn't have a glass feel or anything. It almost feels plasticky, and the bottom of it gets so stained. We actually got that sink from my father-in-law, and we cut it down. So it was actually part of a whole entire, like, countertop thing. And my husband just cut it uh, into, like, a square to fit to go in the hole or whatever for the countertops um but i do remember that the sink had something crazy green in it like you know outside was growing in it because it was sitting outside it was just that it wasn't even going to be used or anything i was like you know what we can use that and i have tried so many things um to keep it clean and i think i have never actually told y'all what kind of material it was um and i think a lot of people assume that it may be like some porcelain type thing but it's not um it is like a plasticky feel so i did want to say that because y'all all give me such great Great recommendations and I don't know if anybody has a sink that is like this um, I actually have a running list when anybody comments any kind of recommendation um, to help me like when it comes to if I ask like hey I don't know how to get this stain out of the carpet um, y'all tell me some great things so I have a running list on my phone in the notes that has you know whatever y'all say to use and it has y'all's username by it that way if I ever do um, put anything like that in my youtube video i'll be like hey my subscriber so and so said this so y'all keep them coming i love when y'all help me out um it so many times things have really worked out my stove used to be awful the stove top and y'all helped me get that straightened out and um, cleaned up looking good so yeah y'all do not ever stop the recommendations coming i love them but the sink i just I, I, i've tried so many things um all the recommendations on here i mean so much stuff barkeeper's friend all that stuff and i think it's because the material of the sink i'm thinking it just soaks it in and stains it but y'all look at how good all this looks i'm so proud of myself i can't believe i did it um that was really overwhelming and the end is just satisfying at this point that i realized that gracie had got herself hung up in my pocketbook like what is she doing it's a goat and pony show over here y'all all the time i mean what in the world how did she even get herself in that situation i guarantee you she was plundering in my pocketbook trying to find some candy or something and now she's like mommy you saved me you saved me i was near death she surely was y'all that is it for today i really hope y'all enjoyed this video if it doesn't hit home for you today make sure you save it to a playlist on youtube or something and just remember that you can always come back to it whether it's two years down the road maybe it'll hit home for you but i love y'all toodaloo